20 years from now what will be the you are not going to always have a calculator in your pocket. And what if your phone doesn't have service? You won't always be living with your parents. Fingers crossed. Finish your food. There are people in Africa starving. Well you can't automate everything. Tell that to my car that drives itself, house that cleans itself, yard that mows itself, and coffee that makes itself. But, sure, that one thing you're thinking of totally can't be automated. You're not always going to have someone to clean up after you. Robot Butler has entered the chat. I have a right to online privacy. There's plenty more fish in the sea won't make any sense. Edit. This comment doesn't really answer OP's question. I delete it but some of the responses are pretty good. You're not always going to have autopilot in your car. You are always going to have a calculator in your pocket. What's the Wi-Fi password? Clean air doesn't grow on trees. You're not going to have internet access everywhere. Teacher saying you're not allowed to use a Wikipedia article. You're not always going to be able to access your brain's memory files. Sometimes you may need to remember things off the cuff. ITT. People misunderstanding the premise of the question and talking about brain computers and stuff. It's supposed to be something that people actually say today which might turn out to be completely wrong. The cell phone service one is a good example. The 10 different mind computer ones are not. You better actually learn this because your Neuralink won't work on Mars. You're not always going to have a strong Wi-Fi signal in your brain chip. 